today on Hey We're Talking. Sex tubs, dead air, and Vegas weddings. And I'm black, Danny Black, and I got to get back to my honeymoon. So let's make this a quick episode, huh? Has this show jumped the shark? Stay tuned to find out. Hey, we're talking. Why do you not like that, Derek? I don't understand what it is about me welcoming people to the show you don't enjoy. I just, I just don't know why, you, why you have to be so aggressive right off the bat. Just say, hey, it's hey, we're talking. Why do you got to go, hey, hey, bust people's eardrums? Who would want to listen to something where someone goes, hey, what is this, NPR? Welcome to Hey, We're Talking. Very glad to have you on the show. Just this be thing. normal, Scott. Just I like am be being yourself. normal. Be normal. Hey, uh, this is hey. what I do when I when I see people. I'll be like, hey, I yell at them. I don't care. That's why your wife throws stuff at you all the time. She never throws anything at me. She should. She throws something at me, but I'm not going to tell you what it is. Whoa. Oh, oh, hey, <laughs> hey, Cheryl. She's going to hit you. She will. That. Yeah, she's going to like write a nasty comment. No, for you she now. does. Do you notice that all the comments she leaves? I told her. I go listen. Stop putting the comments while you're listening because we always do whatever you she called us a bunch of idiots the other day did you see that she's like all of you are idiots because we weren't remembering somebody's name when we were talking about some movie or something like that and then literally within minutes we said the person's name and she was like oops i didn't know that you knew who it was and i'm like yeah stop calling us names that's good that's good you want more comments that's good but who when people are like this guy, but people are like, who, what do you mean? Who is this guy? Danny? Everybody yeah, knows who this? Danny oh. Black is. What are you talking about? Not. Hey, hey, not everybody knows who Danny Black is. Now, if you've been a if you've been a friend of the show for a while, if you've been listening <laughs> to the show, the show, we know who Danny Black is. But yeah. if you're new, Danny Black is a he's Danny American. Black. He's a, you know, he's an American singer living in Australia. Who, uh, he's a singer? A singer. A on singer. Oh, he's, he's one of those so- sewing machines. One of those singer, singer. sewing machines. Singer. Danny Black is a longtime friend of the show. So yes. if, long time if you're, First time if you're watching on YouTube, you're probably you're like, you're ignoring this guy. But if you're listening to the podcast, welcome to Danny Black. Hey, thanks. And everyone on the podcast, all the, uh, what is it, 10 people? <laughs> no, uh, there's thanks. way more. There's thousands. Oh, way more. I'm just kidding. Thousands. Yeah. No, Danny, tell them what your channel is and everything, and then we'll start just chatting with you. Uh, So my channel is called Where's Danny Black? And it's just a documentary lifestyle of me because I have all these crazy adventures that I'm fortunate to have, and I bring the camera along, and it takes a lot of work to do that, and I'm getting a little bit burnt out, but I'm still loving it. I need a break. I need a vacation. You're on Wait, vacation. Your whole, yeah, your whole life's a vacation. Oh, yeah. What are you talking about? <laughs> no, when he shows like the when when he shows like those videos of when he's on the cruise ship and stuff, I'm like, that ain't a vacation. I mean, it is, but it isn't. No, I'm working hard. It's like I'm like in, I'm like in bed for like 16 hours playing Candy Crush, and then oh, it's time to <laughs> time to play. Okay, I'll go play. You're not supposed to tell I'll everybody that. Bar. I was trying to make it sound like you worked really hard. But the videos... Oh, sorry. He uh, puts tons of work into the videos. Let's be real. Yeah, tons of work. It's, so, it's really a lot of work. You know, the thing that's always killer that people don't understand when you're making videos... So it's basically, just so everybody understands, too. It's really... It's a vlog. It's like Danny just shows you his life, what's going on, what he's doing, where he's going. And he has the benefit of having the backdrop of being in Australia. He's an American living in the outback. He's... Now a married man living in Australia. Congratulations! Yeah, I'm on my honeymoon right now. Yeah, he's on his honeymoon, and his 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 wife is like, "Why are you doing a podcast on our honeymoon?" Or is she okay with it? She just she's waiting for me. She's like, "Come on, Danny, finish that podcast." <laughs> she's like, "Finish the podcast." I, I don't know what's wrong with you, Danny. I know. Why I are would you not on be a on podcast? this show? <laughs> I'd be 
I don't know if you could hear that, but she just went bold. <laughs> ah. <laughs> ah, that's funny. Anyway, so the cool thing is, like I said, Danny lives in Australia. He's originally from the United States. I know him uh, from way back in Michigan. Detroit. You were his babysitter, days. right? Scott? No, I was not his babysitter, but pretty basically. close. Pretty close. Uh, I didn't. I was basically as childish as the high schoolers I worked with back then. So anyway. Yes, that's- uh, but that's what it is. It's a vlog. He gets to do all these cool things. He goes on boats. He goes on cruise ships. He goes all over Australia shooting all this cool stuff. Lots of drone shots, all that cool stuff. It's amazing. So go see his channel. Where is Danny Black? Subscribe. Yes. And if you're a subscriber to Derek's channel, unsubscribe from his and subscribe to Danny's. <laughs> it's not like you have, you have that many coins. and you have You're only allowed out. to subscribe to a certain number of channels, so. That actually should be an interesting thing, wouldn't it? I think, I think Danny's channel is is awesome, and it is. If it and he's about to overtake me as far as subscribers on my personal but channel. But never, and, never overtake for cool factor because you you win there. <laughs> what are you talking wow. about? What are you for talking those, about? Yeah, those who know me are like, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, in the sixty five and over demographic yeah. or something. <laughs> Gosh, <laughs> it's mean. It's not true. It's like people our age and older, yeah. But no, wait, wait! Don't say our age. You and I aren't the same we're age. Close. We're not close. We're not really. Close. You're in that. You're forty five and up. I I'm am. I am forty five. Thirty eight and, and below. Okay. But I'll, Danny, I'll, how old are you? Um, I'm younger than thirty eight. That's okay. For sure. good. Okay, that's what I thought. And Derek is what thirty seven. Uh, yeah. Okay. Thirty seven. All right, you guys. Dang, suck. you guys old. Enjoy it. While it lasts, kids, because pretty soon yeah, you'll kids, be sitting here with, with this asleep. white beard. That's what you got coming your way, just so you know. Isn't Not that me. that saying? It's uh, you. You start off. There's four steps in life. You believe in Santa Claus. You don't believe in Santa Claus. You are Santa Claus. You look like Santa Claus. Yep. There you I go. I saw that. I saw That's that. That's true. I don't believe Very in Santa true. Claus. So no. So where are you at, Scott? <laughs> Uh, like I'm pretty Claus. close. I could be Santa Claus pretty soon. I I use the uh, touch of gray shampoo in the hair on top, so I get rid of a lot of it. We're, we're glad you didn't mention the, have, the bottom. I have some, like I screwed up the the beard. Do you guys have the? I don't think I've ever seen you guys do this. Like where you're trimming up the beard and you screw it up and you just have to shave the whole thing off and start over. I've done that. I've I've had a couple of videos where I get on the cruise ship and I came back from. I'm from America to Australia and I forgot like I had a clippers that I haven't used in it forever and I was in the shower doing it not looking and also yeah. I was like ah oh, crap and I yes. have this stupid fat face when I shaved my <laughs> beard and I'm like gosh man these are so slimming they do help that's true um I don't I don't know if I see Bob do that Derek have you ever done that do you ever have to start over uh not completely I've trimmed it a little too too thin before, but my, I usually keep mine pretty thin now. But a long a few years ago, I kept it fairly thick, which was a disaster Why? in itself. Uh, it, everybody loved you get it. Stuff like, caught in it what, or what? It just was not appealing to my wife. Oh, there it is! <laughs> ding 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 ding. Hello. Number but I was one. like, everybody Hello. loves it. I was like, everybody on YouTube and Instagram loves it. Smell my beard. You know what's cool is I just realized everybody on this show now can say my wife. Huh? Look at that. That's true. Everybody gets to say it now. Danny can say it. Go ahead, Danny. Give it a test run. Oh, he disappeared again. Uh, right? My wife. Say, there he goes. There yeah. it is. Yeah. I yeah. lost him. Cheryl's going to be very happy about that. Did I just lose that. him? You, no, we're, you can, no, we're we here. can hear you, no. but we can't see you anymore. I'm there. Okay. Okay, there you are. All right. Stop Sorry, playing I'm with on your this, camera. Uh, what's wrong with you? In. It's oh. Holiday Inn internet. You know, it's That's just bad. in the middle of nowhere. It's, it's not Sorry. the greatest. I, I, I've done several shows from Holiday Inn yes, you have. internet, and it's not not the greatest. <laughs> uh, as far as my beard, Scott, I, I have messed it up because I try to keep like this this specific line going down the edge of my face and clean up everything that grows up to my eyeballs. Yeah. And I, I've kind of trimmed it down and went, oh, man, I went too low. So then I, I'm luckily I was able to get rid of the 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 rest of the beard and just kind of keep the chin. Yeah. So, if you I mean, keep the chin, I'll let you're that, usually halfway back back. okay. Keep the chin. You guys were talking about that on an episode, right? Yeah. It was uh, <laughs> yeah. trying to figure out what this was called. And it's it like was, the French something. What is this it is the goats, French the goatee, cut? but something. I did that once. I shaved this just for the fun of it. And I look like a, like a, 
like a cheesy youth pastor. Like yeah, it was ridiculous. That's exactly it. That's exactly what it is. It's the, it's that's the it's the youth pastor cut. That's what it should be. And called. then you take this part off, and it's like the you know the opposite of a youth pastor. Well, it's either, it's either it's either different way. The yeah, it's either a policeman, a pedophile, or a a porn star. One we, of the we three. just got demonetized because we said pedophile. <laughs> We didn't say pedophile. You no, he did. Way. He said you're either a policeman, a pedophile, <laughs> yeah, or a porn right. star. Well, now that you've said it 18 times, yeah, we're definitely demonetized. <laughs> we won't get 20 cents. That's, say pedophile. Only, that's that's what they say in Australia. <laughs> so a pedophile? A pedo. In the UK. Pedophile. Pedo. So, so let me ask you, Danny. You when On your uh, trip in America, you went to Outback Steakhouse, correct? Yeah. So did what, you really? So what did you think? He's, it was he awesome. Was, he's I had gone a gift to card Outback thing, Steakhouse so. before he left us for Australia. I'm just, I'm just. He's been in Australia for years now, it's so not I just figured same, it's not the same food at all from what they have in Australia. I mean, Australia has normal food, but <laughs> it's not like you know they don't have blooming onions in Australia. <laughs> no, know. that's so stupid. It makes no sense. So, what did Emma think of it? That's what's really important. Yeah, Emma, what did you think of Australia of uh, Outback Steakhouse? She's like, it was pure crap. Hashtag better. We, we just did. Why you said you liked it? <laughs> hey, Outback, if you want to sponsor the show, exactly. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> there we um, go. It was good. We we split a big steak, a big like porterhouse or something like that. No rules. Just uh, right. she liked the bread. You know the bread, the free oh, bread. That yeah. They there? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Like the butter, the honey butter. Oh, yes. So good. Yeah, that's good. No doubt about that's it. Good. Outback Steakhouse knows how to do the bread. Let's just be real. Knows how to do the bread. But, no rules, just bread. But let's be clear. <laughs> Outback Steakhouse is a quintessential American institution, yes. Yes. for sure. Oh, that's... for sure. But they do well, have Foster's like... beer, so that makes you pretend it's it's Australian. Which is Foster's even big in Australia? Uh, no, Foster's was was it was uh, created by Australians, but it's brewed and created in America. So oh my gosh. it's not even. I don't think they even have it in Australia. I feel like I've been yeah. lied to my whole life now. So let me ask you this. Danny, does the Taco Bell in Australia taste the same as the Taco Bell no. here in America? No. Nope. <clears throat> Kangaroo meat to- tastes-, tastes totally different. <laughs> <laughs> now, I don't know, because they have ch- their cheese is white, and our cheese is yellow. And we actually had to look it up, because the Australians that came out for the wedding, they're like, that's gross. Why is the cheese yellow? Gross. And we looked it up, and it's, it's, it's the stuff that the cows eat that makes it yellow. It's like the grass that they have here. It's, it's not like necessarily gross and gross stuff or things that they put in it is just a yeah yeah so yeah. australia is more pure there's better better pure. cows in no, australia I don't, I don't know about that i'm sure it's true <laughs> don't you think aren't we just like Sorry. totally processing there's a square stuff? outside the window it was like enthralled with that you said there's a, there's, a, there's a squirrel by the window yeah, why are you so excited about that? <laughs> She's never seen an American squirrel before. Well, yeah, at American least there's at least there's no uh, birds chirping like Jay Boston's had going on recently. <laughs> yes. Oh, Speaking that's a little of, insider yeah, info, guys. Cast. Jay Boston just no. Made that's on uh, if you if you watch any of the uh, Creator Cast videos that uh, Danny is a part of. Uh, Jay's there been s- sitting on his porch and got all this chirping oh, of he birds. Derek much did like, up, huh? Derek, he did a little yeah, Derek. Derek Derek did that all the time. Oh my gosh! Do you remember those? And we'd be like, Derek, seriously, what are you doing, man? And they're like, Jeep, Jeep, yeah. Jeep, 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 Jeep. He's just... secretly happy. He's like, Hey, that's great. <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> Did you tell it's Jay recording. not to do that? Were you like, Dude, don't pull a Derek? Uh, <laughs> that's Ben on's job. He, he does the the tough the tough stuff. I know. But you guys should have Ben on the show sometime. Yeah, we're ben going on. to. We're going to. That's Enough. the thing I was going to say. So I'd call him like Benin and whatever. And then I was watching one of I his videos that. recently. And he was like, on. somebody called him Ben. And he was like, I guess that's okay. Although my name is Benin. Ben on. And I was like, okay. <laughs> From now on, ben on, it's Ben on. Hey, I've I been it's on funny. his show. Huh? Ah! There you go. There you go. All right. Drum sets over there. I can't get there fast enough. Sorry. Benon is probably racking up some views right now because he keeps having a girl in a bikini on his show. Drinking Jack Daniels. <laughs> Drinking Jack Daniels and Coke. That's Just the wait thing. for my honeymoon clickbait. I have a honeymoon vlog. <laughs> there you go. Yes, dude. Danny's going to be getting some clickbait from, action too. From, Emma, uh, from, from the sex tub. From, from here. <laughs> Don't say that, but it's true. Well, I mean, you're on your honeymoon, dude. Everything that's in that whole entire place has got sex 
on it, probably. <laughs> Sorry. Probably a very dirty room right now. Yeah. No, it's clean. It's oh, married. I like, it's married sex. I like Scott's choice of words. It's got sex on it. Well, that happens when you get married. I, I feel like you, you guys have a lot of catchphrases that you guys can put on T-shirts. I think this dead it's got air sex one. On a dead air. <laughs> sex, it's got sex on it. That's actually pretty funny. That would be a good one. Sex on it. <laughs> my wife. My wife. I no, we can't do that one. My wife would kill me. She hates it. Who would she, she, who would kill you? My wife. I can't do it, man. <laughs> she hates it so much. She's like, I can't believe how many times Derek said my wife on this show. And I was like, he it's his thing. It's never gonna stop now. Your family likes to criticize me, Scott. Are you your dad kidding? thinks I'm a, your dad thinks I'm an idiot. Your wife thinks I say <laughs> that too much. <laughs> She's gonna love that. We need to get that as a drop and just play it every once in a while. Your wife. How about as a ringtone? Yeah, I was, I was just going to say, he's got to get his a ringtone. Oh, Perfect. Danny, by the way, did you yeah. hear on the podcast when I talked about the fact that I don't have an iPhone anymore? Was that recently? I'm sure it was. Yeah. Did I talk about it recently? Okay. I can't remember. Yeah. Yeah, did. the last two episodes I'm saving for our little road trip that we have tomorrow. So, Dude. Saving them up. I got rid of my iPhone. Can you believe it? Why? Bye. Don't spoil don't spoil okay, the episode spoil for it. him, yeah. Scott. I got Why? a Google, yeah, I got and a Google find Pixel. Out. Google Pixel 2 XL. Cool. Just so you know. Speaking right. of uh speaking of saving up the episodes, uh Danny, I think your your vlogs, your YouTube channel, that's it's like a professional type production. And I know your episodes, each video is like five to ten minutes long. So I like to save them up. To watch yeah. several in a row, so I can, so it feels more like a documentary, and I, that That's to me good. is more enjoyable. And I was planning on watching your North American tour tonight, but then I get a message from Scott saying, "Hey, we're gonna have Danny on the show." So I'm like, "Well, we better catch up now." <laughs> so that was cool, getting to see Mexico City, Salt Lake City, Shelby, Montana, Bant. <laughs> Dude, Banff is like the prettiest place I've ever. That looked ever beautiful, been to. but so cold. I was like, no, too cold. Oh, yeah. so cold. Too cold. So, so cold. And it's Michelle. ridiculous here in Lake Tahoe. It should be like, like, like two feet of snow or something, and there's no snow. What? Like they're dying out here. Yeah, it's crazy. Like we we're gonna go skiing and stuff, and just there's nothing out here. So, yeah, because it's, uh, uh, it's all down by Scott. It's all down by Derek melted. and Scott. It melted away today. <laughs> Um, oh, I don't, don't so, have any snow here. Yeah, you don't have snow. But we got it in South Carolina. We got like two inches, and then now it just all melted today. Um, the other thing about that Mexico City vlog was yeah. you just went with this dude, this random dude, and I was like, he's going to straight up murder Danny on this show, and we're going to, this is the footage. Do you and not I'd freak out a little bit like when you go somewhere with somebody like that? No, nah, that guy was nice. I mean, I met him. From the night before when I played that big uh, right. party, and he worked, he worked there. So um, it's weird. I, I would have totally, like in my head, I would have thought that. But when you're there and you see the place and you realize it's not like as crummy as you thought it was going to be, it's actually the yeah. opposite. It's beautiful, um, and everybody's nice. Like I know when I first got there, like I was by myself and I was hungry, so I went outside and I just went to the convenience store that was literally right next door to the hotel. And I still was like, okay, I better not bring my cameras or anything because I don't want to get stolen or get you know, get uh, robbed, whatever. So it's just, it was very oddly. Yeah. He's, he got stuttered a little bit, his holiday and stuttered, but that's oh, okay. sorry. No, it's okay. All I'm saying it was good. It was good. Yeah. Mexico City is one of those ones that you hear about and you're like, oh man, be careful in Mexico City. So when you went with that guy, I was like, oh God, please keep him safe. <laughs> I liked in the video, y'all mentioned you. that it was, that area was used in the, uh, James Bond, because I just saw that yeah. movie a few weeks ago. And Which movie? Fun yeah. fact. Fun Spectre. fact. It, Spectre. Um, that whole parade that they have at the beginning, mm -hmm. um, they never do that. They never did that. But now, since that movie came out, they do it every year. But that what? was never a real parade. That whole Day of the Dead thing, they never had that going on. And then now they do it every year because of that. That's interesting. That is cool. Yeah. I didn't think that one was very good, by the way, as James Bond flicks go. Not my favorite. Although they're all, you yeah. know, they're all James Bond movies. I, I, ha I haven't seen it. Yeah. So. <laughs> no way. <laughs> no kidding. Really? Unbelievable. Although Bob wait, has wait, stepped up his movie game. Day? 
What's talking that? about Will Smith the other day? I don't like that. And I was, it's not that good. You know, oh man. Do you, you like that me. one? Independence Day. That was like, well, you know, I was an impressionable young person when it exactly. came out. Exactly. You were probably a older teen, and you were like, eh, I was old. Old. aliens. I was old. I just, I'm not a big science fiction guy. Is the problem? Like that's against the Bible. I, still <laughs> I, didn't watch... think, I didn't think that at all. <laughs> I still watch Independence Day. Welcome to Earth. <laughs> yeah, Earth. Yeah. Does he say Earth? He doesn't. He, he doesn't. Does. Oh, he doesn't. But, but everybody remembers. Everybody remembers. Everybody thing. says that he says that. But His name was... is Will Smith for crying out loud. <laughs> Smith. <laughs> My tooth. <laughs> My tooth. Uh, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> What are we doing? This is terrible. All right. It's hey, we're talking. Yeah. So Independence Day, seriously, I just, I don't know. My buddy Bill loves that. He thinks it's I like the it. greatest thing ever. And I'm always just like, it eh. is. It was, it's held up. It's good. He um, also I mean, likes those Planet of the Apes movies. Okay. The new ones. Are you kidding me right now? Please, guys, like tell me you don't like But those. I like the last, the last one was pretty good. The oh, one that just came out was actually pretty good with uh, Woody like Harrelson. A, like a bunch of monkey people? No, thank you. No it's against so. the Bible, Scott. I know. <laughs> no, it's just stupid. I hate it. I hate it. He was playing him on New Year's <laughs> Eve in the other room when we were over there, and I was just like, are you guys really watching this movie right now on New Year's Eve? This is how we're going to have fun, watching Planet of the Apes? Please stop. And it was the don't Woody judge. Harrelson one, too. And don't yeah, judge people's actually, life choices, Scott. Movie. No, I always judge people's life choices when it comes hey, to movies. Hey, by the way, especially. you know how YouTube changes uh, thing for getting channels to be monetized if they're small channels? Um, you have to have so many watched hours. I think it's like in the last 12 months, you have to have 10,000, 4,000 hours. It yeah. ends up working out to be like 11 hours a day for the last year that people have to watch. So maybe this what? should be a really long episode and just tell people if you don't want to watch the whole thing, just just let it all, like sit on, on your yeah. computer or on your phone. Just play just it walk every day. Away and- hey, you, you know, guys, uh- listen, there's all these stupid things. Like when I first started watching PewDiePie, um, he – would literally make the videos they had to be 10 minutes long basically to get monetized and he would just put four minutes of of like him repeating something at the very end of like a six minute video (laughs) so that it made it to the 10 minute mark i was just like this is so stupid youtube just let people if they watch it they watch it if they don't why do they have to watch 10 minutes of it it's so stupid yeah but anyway it's it's not like that now the ten minute thing. No, but he still. I think you almost can get, all his yeah, videos are just exactly. watch time. I think it's like if you have ten minutes, ten to fifteen minutes, it like pushes you up higher in a recommendation for you know viewed videos and stuff like that. Yeah. So since we're talking about YouTube people, let's let's hit a hot topic because then we can put this in that we can put it in our little hashtags and maybe people will come look at it. They won't, but let's talk about Logan Paul, everybody. Do you know, <laughs> remember what? Do you know what happened with Logan Paul? I have to educate people if they don't know. Do you know what happened, Bob? What happened with yeah. Logan Paul? Uh, he was doing a vlog. I what was it in Japan or China? Yeah, he was um, disgracing the entire yeah. country of Japan. Yes, go ahead. And he basically went. Th- through the woods in an area where people traditionally kill themselves. And he basically vlogged a dead body uh, hanging from a tree. Yeah. And uh, obviously that caused tons of backlash for, for many reasons. And now it seems like, I don't know if YouTube totally bumped his channel, um, but I know he's not. I, I saw at one point that he was no longer monetized and then no longer recommended. And I don't know if they t- totally bumped his channel, but no, I mean, he that's still really has a what. Channel. He still has his channel, but he got removed. The channel's from, growing better than ever. <laughs> I know. Isn't that stupid? So he got kicked off of YouTube Red. Listen, he was YouTube's golden child. That's the thing. Logan Paul was like one of their little buddies. They loved him. They were promoting the crap out of him. He showed up on Trending every single day. Him and his brother are literally, I mean, look, I'm not going to be mad at anybody for having a career, but seriously, they are straight up. It's so stupid. I can't believe that people watch it, but it's like young kids. That's the thing. It's like being mad at Backstreet Boys or NSYNC back in right. the day for, and it's like all these little kid fans. Yeah, there's like, how are they so popular or whatever? But it's just they appeal to the young kitties, and that's you know that's that wins. But unfortunately, like the Boys stuff that that Logan and Jake do, <laughs> it's not really appropriate for little kitties. That's the worst part. Absolutely, but they're I mean, showing Jackass like a, wasn't either. And we all love Jackass. Like, <laughs> That's that true. Like, That's true. Well, I mean, he's still got 59 million subscribers. Um, Who, Logan? Yeah. No. He has no, 59? 59? 
No, are you so sure? 15.9. 15. It says 59 M. What? He does not have. He did not pass subscribers. PewDiePie. You're looking at PewDiePie. Oh yeah, I am. Sorry. <laughs> I was like, it's, dude, it switched. I oh, typed it in and it switched. So that scared me. I was like, if Logan like, Paul like, passed PewDiePie, I'm done with YouTube. That's it. That was the last straw. Nope. I clicked the wrong button. My bad. That's Sorry. okay. That was good for the conversation. It made us all freak out. Although Derek was just like, I don't really care who has. What. No, he's got 15 million. Yep. His brother um, probably is at like 12. He's not, he's Jake. It's They're... sad, but I have like a thing, an app that, that I like to, I mean, now it's kind of fun to watch. And it's like, is it show your sub- subscriber count going up? Oh, God. oh wow. And it's real time. So that is so like, crazy. Oh, 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 he's going oh, down. Oh, oh. That's oh, crazy. See, Quit no, doing it's... that, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Think of cryptocurrency. Why can't we put money on like YouTube creators? That's true. And, like, like that should be the next thing. I'd invest money in that. I think that would be interesting. Uh, we're, man, we're we're hitting a lot of topics right now. Was it wasn't uh, there? So that, isn't there a platform that just has that? Pretty much, you go on, watch the videos, and you can you can yeah donate right there. Philly to D that. Is con- Philly D is part of it. It's like a it's a new crypto that they're trying to put together. I can't remember the name of it, but he's part of it. So. Well, I've seen a lot oh. of them, a lot of different ones where you could donate actual money or whatever. Sure. Uh, right right there on the video, uh, you know, open chat for you live. Can do that uh, live in- you can stuff. do that on YouTube in Super Chat, and you can do it on Twitch. I know for sure. There's there's a browser you're thinking of, like a browser called like Kings or Knights or something with a K. I'll have to look at. Yeah. So I I, then, I will. Sorry, Danny. I will say Logan Paul did uh, post a video. His last video was two weeks ago. Uh, basically, an apology sorry. video. Uh, Forty five million. Which he views. monetized. Which he yeah. monetized, by the way. His his yeah. apology video. Got monetized. Yeah, yeah but right? he said he was going to put that money towards something like oh, uh, some kind of suicide. Break. I don't know. I, I'll be honest with you. I didn't think the the video was bad yet. Actually, let's roll the clip. Do we have a clip? Oh, no clip. Okay. Uh, <laughs> that would be we're not, so we're great not that if we, adv- we don't have a we don't have a budget for that, Danny. Especially Sorry. the best part of it is, is like, hey, can we roll the clip? And we're just literally, we are freewheeling it on the show. Like, we have no, there's no direction whatsoever. And Danny's like, can we roll the clip? I'm thinking to myself, we didn't plan one ounce of what we're talking about on this show today. Uh, but yeah, so you can watch the whole video on Live Week. No, um, thank they have you. it there. And it's not like, this, the stupid part is, is that how does he not have somebody around him going, Maybe you shouldn't yeah, do that. Like, exactly. That's probably a good idea. And to me, I thought the backlash, like if you watch the whole thing, it's it's stupid. It's sad. Um, his reactions, he, they could have cut a lot of his stupid reactions out. <laughs> I know. He's, that made he just it looks like bad. an idiot. But I, like I get, you know, it's it's not like far fetched. If I saw a dead body, like I'd kind of have the weird reaction yeah. to it as well. But I just think that the backlash was way worse than than what it is people are just looking for any reason to hate on them yeah, yeah. on like all brothers like any reason i agree anything but, that's, that's dumb well a lot of people do that with anyone who's successful i mean like yeah. realistically let's look let's talk about one of the biggest youtubers that does vlogs which would be casey neistat you know yeah. people just bash on him just to bash on him who I mean, bashes just, on yeah. casey oh look go go uh, read some of the yeah, comments don't, don't go you know, when, the comments. sad yeah i mean <laughs> that's i mean why, the guy like, he's I never look at anybody's comments no, so that that's the thing. Some people just love to to bash on it. Like we get a few thumbs down every time we post a video for no reason. I mean, yeah. somebody just doesn't like our show, and that's that. So, um, I mean, you're going to get that no matter what you put up, uh, even if you have some of the greatest content. To me, it's it's funny. I watch a lot of uh, Christian music videos and stuff like that, so I can listen to the drums and mm-hmm. watch some of the videos for drums and stuff mm-hmm. like that, so I can learn it. Mm-hmm. And it's amazing to see how many thumbs down are on it, you know, with no comments, and it's like. Wait a minute. This is Elevation Worship showing you how to play a yeah. song on drums. Why would you thumbs down it? If you don't want to watch it, don't watch it. But why thumbs a down lot it? Of haters you know? out there. This people never people makes just any do sense it on YouTube. Never no. makes sense. But I think, I think they, what they should have instead of this, instead of this, they should have like if if you if you hit this, then the numbers are up, and then as soon as it gets lower, like if people hit a thumbs down button instead of showing how many thumbs down, it just takes it off of the thumbs up. And then if it goes lower, then it's just thumbs down with a bunch of numbers. But you know they what? should also be able to track or something 
you know, uh, who's putting the thumbs down because yeah. and, and the reason <laughs> you, it, guys well, get them, you guys get them all the time. And I'm like, who is that one person well, that hits a thumbs down? Like right when you post it, it's I like, mean, literally yeah. it's like within minutes. Well, at least they're subscribed and they get yeah. the ding of the bell That's when, true. when we they... post it. But to it's me, it's Derek. There's... It's Derek. It is Derek. It's Derek, <laughs> are you doing it? Is hey, it you? I hear thumbs downs are great for engagement and. Yeah. Hey, I just want to point something out real quick though, because if wait, 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 Bob's hands open. I, I know. He's got a point he's trying to finish. But I gotta tell, I gotta tell this, or we're gonna miss it because it was so good. If you're watching on the show, it was really fun to see. Danny literally is like he was doing the picture for you. Like it, it actually <laughs> looks like the picture on YouTube of the thumbs up and the thumbs down. You should so you, sc- you should screenshot that and then make that the the I face will. of this, be this our, video. That'll be our uh, thumbnail. Yeah, Which again exactly. is another part of YouTube that we don't do a good job at. Thumbnails are like, you know, we need we need a chick in a bikini on every one of ours for some reason, and that'll help. Do it. Do no, it. No, click. Just do it. <laughs> click All right. Well, that's, I'll, that's I'll put on the bikini. <laughs> <laughs> that would get a lot of views, I bet. Wow, we got eight hundred and thirty <laughs> thumbs down on a four second video. That's crazy. <laughs> I've seen a video that someone was just trying to test the whole dislike thing, and the whole video just says. It's like a weird zombie voice. He's like, just dislike, dislike. <laughs> and then he's got like 1,500 likes because everyone wants to do the opposite or they think it's just hilarious. I just, I just, what I, what I was saying to wrap up my point, I just wish there was some sort of accountability, something that says, hey, you're, th- you know, you're giving this video a thumbs down. Why are you giving them a thumbs down and kind of keep track sense. of the haters? Why, you know, but why would anyone do that? They wouldn't do well, the <laughs> thumbs down then. That's you give the, the thumbs point. down, and then a survey pops up. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, if you're going to give this video a thumbs down, we need to know why. Yeah, at least make it more difficult. <laughs> oh, my God. Although you, know? you might not want to know why, because I did it. My, my most popular video is this Nola Board video where we drove on this really long, the longest road in Australia. And it's, it was, it's popular because people want to do it. And I got this guy that commented one time, and he's like, he's like, can't you just show the Nola Board? I'm so sick of these guys with their glasses and their beards and their blah, blah, blah. And he gets really negative on me. And I was like, this, this wasn't the whole point. Like, I don't get how I could have not shown, I could have shown you a different video. Like it was so annoying. I just, I get to the point where I was like, you know what? I'm going to delete the comment because it's not worth engaging in. Like, I don't even care. Yeah. Quit yeah. wearing glasses and having I a know, beard. I, know, right? I mean, go get <laughs> LASIK or something, dude. <laughs> Yeah, that's yeah. weird. When they start going after the person's appearance, that's when it's just like, how stupid do you have to be? Well, seriously? I think too, like if you have like, because that video's got like over fifteen thousand views, and I think if someone sees that, they think that I'm so popular, I'm not going to see the comments. So he's writing that comment to everyone else that's looking at the comments. Yeah, so it's like right. I can't can't stand these guys to do that. Not just talking to me, just talking to everyone else. And I'm yeah. like, you do realize that I'm a person, not like some <laughs> stupid company that doesn't see these things. So. <laughs> Yeah, I've seen those on my channel, too. That's why I just comment on the video without commenting in the comments. I'll just say, like, Logan Paul looks like a total douchebag, but I don't write that. I just just out loud. Yeah, I just say it out loud as I'm watching. I'm like, (laughs) who gave him this haircut? What a douchebag. That's what I say. I don't go like the tree falls in the forest. Yeah. Yeah. It's like if someone hangs themselves in the forest. If someone hangs themselves in the, the, the suicide forest and you don't see it on video, did they really hang themselves in the suicide forest? Right. Yeah, but there's a lot of other videos on YouTube about the suicide forest. Yeah, that have that, and never got this kind of. But they don't have. Just, the, yeah, but they don't have the person. I don't think they have. They, they don't actually have a uh, dead person in them. Had, um, not like didn't show like their knuckles like they showed on that video. Oh, which dude. Was, that was the story part. I was like, part of it really. Here's the thing. Just to wrap up this Logan Paul thing, because let's be real. Should we be talking about this guy? Probably not. All right. Um, he. The thing that really built up to this whole thing is if you looked at any of the other, I saw a bunch of big creators talking about just what he did while he was in Japan. He just acted like a total douche the whole time he was there. It wasn't like. They did that in Italy too. And that was bad in in Rome. They did the same thing uh, where they just, they were really harassing like the hotel people and like, you know, stuff. And I'm like, don't make Americans look dumber than they already look. Like that's, (laughs) that's the worst part. (laughs) He, yeah, he like when he, the thing that got me was like he was in a temple and there's like this thing where people put coins in this. I don't know if it's a fountain or what it was, but they they put coins in. It. It's almost like, you know, prayers. And he's like throws these coins up in the air like he's taking a jump shot and is like says something about I want more bees, more hoes and something like that was his wish. 
at a temple he's doing this and eventually the the japanese police came and made him leave but it's like dude come on man disrespectful you have to have respect for other cultures i mean you have to especially if you're in their area it's one of the first things he said when he started the video too he was like japan is all about the respect so we want to respect them and then he (laughs) acts like a total idiot through the whole thing and i'm like you're such a jerk so yeah and these kids man i i remember like the jake paul he's got that big song that's like it's every day bro yeah and i sat in front of my nephew and he was like with the disney channel phone he said all the kids in the school know that every word of that song i'm like (laughs) oh Oh, man. And, the, and and all the little kids buy their their merch. That's their whole thing. They make songs, and they literally like Jake Paul. Literally has a song where it's like "Buy my merch, buy my merch, buy my merch." <laughs> and kids, they they download these songs from Apple, from iTunes. You paid for a song where this guy tells you to buy his crap, and then they buy his crap. And the parents hey, are can like, we do it? "Let's do a diss track, or let's do a." Let's do something on here, yeah. you know? We should we should do a buy my merch. <laughs> dead air shirt. Dead air shirt. Dead air shirt. Yeah. Anyway. It's got sex on it. <laughs> that should Smoke be the name pants. of the episode. It's got sex on it. Oh. Yes. Gosh. Yes. Please name this episode. <laughs> and then and, long, and then Danny Black is the thumbnail. Yeah, Danny yeah. Black going like this. It's got sex on it. <laughs> it's got sex on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh this show is like also you notice we didn't take a break because this is kind of a new experimental show oh. that we're doing danny we're gonna do like this is gonna be like an extra show uh i think it's probably gonna be on saturday where we'll just kind of do whatever we want there won't be any of this like let's take a break put it in the, ro- in the rotation right. why not put it in the Make yeah, we regular... can do it however we want. I'm just saying that's hey, originally. If you want a website, go to godaddy.com slash HWT and you get 30 day free trial. <laughs> Emma just bought her thing and we saw that. She's no, like, I she think. She bought her domain. I think, Dang the, it. I think the GoDaddy one is like 10% off or 30% off or something. I don't even know. So you guys could have saved money if you would have went to go- <laughs> whatever the website is. Yeah, it's it's trygodaddy.com slash HWT. See? That would have been perfect. <laughs> let's, let's, I'll, I'll, I'll get on. I'll figure out some good, some better sponsors you guys can get. Okay. Uh, and uh, make them like all, a sex make shop them all Australian. Stuff. Make them all Australian things. Yeah, Outback Steakhouse. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> if you order it online and you type in Outback slash HWT, you hey, get. D- so when we, yeah. so I feel like we're almost at a point where we're just it's naturally starting to be like a wrap up point. So before we go, Danny. I want to ask you, what do you have coming up? What's what's next on the agenda? How much longer are you going to be in the U.S.? Uh, we leave. Uh, I have actually have a gig tomorrow night in Napa Valley. Oh, um, I thought you were going to so say So I haven't Australia. played in like six weeks, so I'm, I'm heading over to Napa Valley. Um, and then we have a long drive back to Salt Lake City, and we leave. on. So in a couple of days, we're going to be leaving back to Australia. And the day after I get there, I have to get on a cruise ship for like 11 days. Oh, wow. And, oh. And then I come back for a week and then another cruise ship for another like 11 days. And then I don't have anything much planned after that. We're kind of, I really want to start writing some music. Um, I'm doing a, I'm going to do like a course on how to edit videos in like my way. Like, yes. Um, to show, to show to the workflow Scott. on how to upload and, um, you know, the right ways to delete stuff or quick tips and tricks. Basically it's going to be like maybe like a five to seven day course where you're going to see the whole thing. And, um, I might put it for sale. I might give discounts to friends or free or whatever. Maybe I'll give it to you guys and you guys can shout it out on your show as a sponsor. Can you just teach um, me how to use Final Cut Pro, please? That's all I'm asking. That's, that's <laughs> yes, the, please the, teach him. That's the idea yeah. um, okay. is to do something like that. So I could just do a straight up beginner course. Anyways, the whole thing, I want to I want to make course. What? Oh, 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 e, uh, uh, okay. There wait, he's back. He's back. Oh, sorry. Sorry. I'm back. I'm, I'm back. And I'm back. And, and, uh, and he's back. So basically, yeah, I'll do some kind of thing to make it easy for people to, to learn how to do it. it it's going to be a lot more work when you watch me edit than you ever thought was going into these videos. It's crazy. No, I know how so, much it's going to be. I know. What, so it's, know. it's uh, editing. It's going to be music. I'm going to be making vlog music and vlog music available for people that want to make vlogs nice. so they can use it without copyrights as long as they bring people to my channel because of that. And that's, uh, awesome. that's, that's the idea. So that's, that's 2018 plus a lot of more traveling and just random stuff that's going to happen. I don't even know. And what, and, and even though Emma's not on the show, what's Emma got coming up? She's going to be Emma's hula hooping. Got, what is she doing? Her, 
she, she, her and her brother started a Brisbane trapeze academy. So like flying trapeze and stuff oh, okay. like that. Nice. Uh, they, they're starting that up and she's also got lots of hula hoop things going on. And uh, yeah, lots of, yeah, you'll see on the channel. I mean, it's every day, bro. It's and what's, day. and what's, what's her channel name so we can go to it. It's uh hip, hip hoop channel, hooray, right? Hip, hip hooray. There you go. And if, when you type it in, you're going to see, did you mean hip hop hooray? Don't exactly. Like that. No, just go to hip hoop hooray and watch yeah. Emma dazzle you with her hula hoopiness. That's right. That's a great she's word, got, hula hoopiness. It is. It's actually it's actually a good workout to hula hoop. She's just taking me some good workout hula hoop things, and I'm surprised because you're you're doing squats and stuff like that while you have hula hoops on your hands. Yeah. And you don't realize you're working out because you're concentrating on your hands so much that you're doing these squats and. Like later on, after like an hour, you're like, "Oh my god, my my legs are so sore." And you're like, "That's good." But I always complain about. It. She's like, "You want to do this?" I'm like, "No." no. Do you and do you I, do it around your waist? Are you good at hula hooping around your waist yet? I I am, but I'm not good at looking good at doing it. <laughs> I'm like, so awkward. That's like, probably really? hula hooping around your waist as a dude is probably good for the getting sex on it, right? Yeah, or I could just save it for that. Oh gosh, I took it too far. I said that he you could do hula hoop sex. You could both get inside the hula hoop and try to hula hoop naked. <laughs> it's not funny that once you're married, you can talk like that. It's, yeah, it's exactly. Just, I wish Emma was hearing all this stuff because I'd like to see her face when I said you should hula hoop. Get in the hoop together and try to hula hoop naked and see how it works. Uh, she might listen to the show. I'm not sure if she will. <laughs> she better. She well, well, she, is she get, one that will like, get? Scott's an idiot. Will she get super embarrassed over it, Danny? No. No, no. Dude, she's not from America. No. All over the world, nobody cares about sex the way Americans do. They don't get all That's true. hung up on it. It's true. Next next week, we're going to see hula hoops in the in Scott's room in the background. <laughs> like, I got my hula well, hoops, guys. Well, typically, on his little table, he's got Kleenex, a measuring tape, and hand lotion. Hand lotion. <laughs> and uh, Kleenex, if you're listening, you want to sponsor the show. Yes. Or and, Or lotion. <laughs> Most people don't. <laughs> most people don't see it because the screen gets cut off. But yeah. that's typically what's on his back table there, which I've questioned many times. But <laughs> he's always got an excuse. A measuring tape. Yeah, a the measuring, measuring tape, tape. Hand lotion yeah. and Kleenex. What about the What about the shots for the? Uh, oh, no, Wait, was oh that on the gosh. show? That was before the show. Never mind. <laughs> our show Our show went so like dirty today. What happened? Yeah, because well, you're trying to keep people listening so that you can get the the views, the minutes watched, so that right. you can get monetized. That's yes. what it is. We're getting up there. All and, right. Uh, yeah. Well, listen. You probably wrap it up. It's been it has been fun as usual talking with Danny, and uh, we want to say again congratulations on your wedded bliss. Very excited Nuptials. for you. And um, again, go to see his YouTube channel. It's fantastic. Where is Danny Black? Go check it out. All sorts of cool videos, and I'm looking forward to you teaching us how to make videos too, because that's going to be sweet. Because you, your yeah. videos are great, and Thank um, you. yeah, I don't know what else what else we can say about Danny except for he's freaking awesome, and we love having him on the show. I think you guys are freaking awesome, and I love I love being on the show. It's weird being on the show because I've watched you so many times that it's like, I feel, am I watching it or am I actually part of it? So and it's out of I, this world. And I think a lot of people feel the same way about you too, Danny. Like, I don't know you, but I feel like I know you because you're, you, you know, know you and I've never met in person and we've talked on the show and stuff like that. But I feel like I know you a lot more just because I watch your vlogs all the time. And I, I mean, I kind of like, I feel like I'm like, man, am I like a creeper that I feel like I know this guy? <laughs> like you know what I mean? Him. It's just weird. Yeah, it's weird. But no, that's just the way it is. No, Danny wants that's everybody sweet. to that's stalk sweet. him on his videos. I do. That's why I do it so that they can watch what he's doing. Hey, by the way, if I, if I show up at your house, I don't want you to be like, what have you been up to? You know what I've been up to. Yeah. That's the thing. I don't want to have that. You don't have to talk day. when you hang out with Danny. You don't have to ask him stuff. You just say, Oh, I already saw that on your video. We don't have to talk about anything. <laughs> sing something. <laughs> yeah. Sing a journey song, Danny. <laughs> yeah. Jenny sing, sing journey, man. Um, <laughs> so Please. one last thing. We yeah. need to get some kind of petition together to help everybody get better internet in Australia because it straight up sucks. <laughs> it sucks on the thing. outskirts. But the is that what it is? Because okay. remember when I was in Brisbane, my internet was amazing. Yeah. I'd upload a video and like 
four minutes, even out oh, here. Oh, good. It sucks. I mean, it took like four hours to load my wedding video that I just posted. When I when I hear those guys talk about how long it gets, it takes them to upload stuff. I'm like, dude, what the heck is going on? It's crazy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's it's sad. I derailed our good ending by talking about that. Derek is very furious. Can I say something really quick? Yeah, do it. If anybody's actually this far in the show, can you make a comment down that you got this far in the show? I just <laughs> think that'd be funny. <laughs> Cheryl's going to be so, Cheryl. No made, Cheryl already made like twelve comments by now. Yelling. At us. <laughs> yeah, Cheryl. Cheryl and Jenny will will make that comment on behalf they of will. you, Danny. Everybody else, will, yeah, we'll They'll see. Be like, eh. This is why, like on SoundCloud or something, like <laughs> you know how, or like even like Facebook, like live videos. You know how if you watch them back, it shows when people like yeah. things and yeah. When people comment, I wish they did that on like these kind of videos on, on YouTube. Because It'd be, be interesting. So or It'd be interesting. videos. I think that'd be funny. Yeah. You'd see how many people actually only made it five seconds and then wrote a comment. And then <laughs> yeah. Got off. Yeah, exactly. Thumbs down, these jackasses. <laughs> All right. Listen, it was fun. Fantastic. We'll have Danny on the show again. So... Yeah, Never I gotta fear. get back to my honeymoon, guys. Yeah, he's gotta go oh, back to honeymoon. Yep. Where's, where's oh, the measuring oh. tape? <laughs> <laughs> open them, open them doors back there, and get the water running. Yeah, get that That's tub right. filled up. Get the bubbles yeah. going. All right, Danny, With thanks that. for being on the show, man. <laughs> yeah. We appreciate you. And uh, oh, my pleasure. You're always welcome to join us anytime you like. Yeah. All right, Derek. Thanks, guys. Say goodbye. And with that, guys, thank you so much for watching. This has been Danny Black. This is Hey, We're Talking. We're done!